Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Office Bloke Aiden. I'm G. I'm Sophie. They were doing a Cat Williams. A lot of requests we've had for Cat Williams. Yeah, I've um, never. I don't think I've ever seen him in. No. I've never really heard no, of him. None, none honest, of us so. have, have heard. Well, we've heard of him, but none of us have, have seen any yeah. of his of his like stand up. <laughs> I know the Office blokes um, like Cat Williams, um, and they said you know we should react to him, and a lot of, yeah. of uh, people in the comments yeah, and stuff have said the same. So. <clears throat> We thought we'd give it a go. Mm, this is white people cannot drink, so I don't know Obviously if you're talking never met to me. me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I drink quite a lot. We all probably drink quite a lot. We've been we've been away for the yeah. weekend, haven't we? And uh, when I put the recycling out, I was like, <laughs> it was just like clattering. Twelve bottles of prosecco, <laughs> eighty bottles of beer. <laughs> how it goes? How it goes? Anyway, that yeah. was just Darren. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, this is white people cannot drink. Cat Williams. But you need your Spanish friends. <laughs> Don't nobody party like them. <laughs> to talk I was, like that. The voice has caught me off guard so much there. <laughs> it sounds like he'd been sucking on a helium balloon. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Jesus, I was not expecting, expecting that. that. But you need your Spanish friends. <laughs> Don't nobody party like them motherfuckers. Nobody in the world party like them motherfuckers. Cause they don't need shit that niggas need. They don't need invitations or streamers or balloons or nothing. Them motherfuckers only need a front yard and some motherfucking corona. And them motherfuckers... <laughs> niggas can't even go to their parties cause they don't never end. <laughs> Fuck you have a party last three and a half motherfucking months. Just got niggas in there hostage. Just... I want to go home, nigga. This is <laughs> Spanish people. You gotta get you some nigga friends too, so they can tell you when shit is not appropriate. We are tired of going to the laundromat to see you in there. Your baby girl is all of seven years old. This bitch has on a wedding dress and soccer shoes. Where the fuck is she going? Is she marrying bleach? Spanish people is if you are pushing a stroller through the mall and your child's feet can touch the ground out the stroller, let little S.A. walk then. This motherfucker 13 goddamn years old. Yeah, I know, I can't lie, that kind of annoys me when I see like... Big kids. Like grown Not children. babies in a stroller. Yeah. I, do you know I hate as well? When I see a baby with tea in a bottle. What? It, it, is that a thing? Yeah. Go to Civic Centre. They're about four years old. They've got a bottle of tea and a sausage roll. <laughs> Don't. Driving, driving that's, my, that's my dinner every day. <laughs> yeah, but a bottle of tea. Like, yeah, who that's gives? a bit strange. If you're going to give your is child... It like, is it warm? Like yeah, hot? like you would make a cup of tea, two sugars, then they put it in a baby bottle and... and Start them young. <laughs> like if you're going to drink tea, teach them how to... Use a, a cup, cup and saucer yeah, or yeah, yeah. Not, not a bottle. What? I, do, I, I used to love a cup of tea. I've always loved tea. And as a kid, we always like, you, do you remember them old gas fires? Yeah. And we used to like, every morning we'd come down like after we got ready and we'd always have a cup of tea waiting for us on the gas oh, really? fire. So it like stayed nice and warm. Yeah. yeah. Wow. Well. Another thing similar to that is when, <laughs> when you like have old kids on, have you seen recently, I've seen like a lot of kids on a leash. Not, they're not a harness. harness. Yeah, it's a harness. Safety. Harness. But like he's on a leash, like he's, he's uh, mum like holding them. That was a, that was a normal thing when, like in the seventies, all um, babies would be on like a harness so that they could walk freely without running off. Running off. Yeah. Which is and basically it, what a leash is. Yeah. But then it became a bit of a taboo subject, and you, you know you were supposed. To, then they they see these, a lot of airports. Yeah, and then they yeah, have these things where you've got a thing around your wrist, and they've got one around their wrist. So you hold the hand, but if they let go of your hand and run off, they can't go far because they've got. Get you. Yeah, I think yeah. it's I think it's sensible to be fair with some kids. Like yeah. you don't know what what they're gonna do. Mm. Do you know I I, I like? Have you seen them trunkies? No. Yeah, when you sit on them. Yeah, and it's like so a suitcase. It's, so it's like a little suitcase. Oh. And, then you, and then you sit and on, you sit them, on they it, and it, and then you and just pull it. it. Yeah. yeah, or they can push along with the feet. I think that's a good idea. Cute. So they can walk. I remember, do you know that person went on Dragon's Den? Really? They were the person who made trunkies, yeah. I think. Yeah, I bought Arlo one. Um, but it's not the trunky, it was a different brand. Yeah. 
Yeah, and he loves it. Anyway, yeah. Let's go back a little I bit. I don't, uh, I agree with that. Having like 13 year olds in a stroller. Weird. The ground out the stroller. Let little S.A. walk then. This motherfucker 13 goddamn years old with a cigarette and a sidekick. Push it faster, S.A. All I'm saying is life is too short for racism. We all got motherfucking problems, but we can learn. We can learn. Just niggas, just fuck that. Just don't try to do everything with your white friends. Don't get drunk with your white friends. Can't do it. Can't fucking do it. They don't drink like niggas. Niggas, we are very consistent. If a nigga drink Hennessy, that's what the fuck that nigga drank. That's what he drank. Hennessy. You ain't gotta keep asking. That's what he drink on Monday, Wednesday, Friday, his birthday, Jesus' birthday, Hennessy. If they don't have Hennessy, he will take Remy as a backup. That's as far as it goes. White people don't care what they drink. All they care about is what they said when they was leaving the house. Tonight, we're getting fucked up. <laughs> All the fuck they care about. Them motherfuckers, you gotta be careful, niggas, because they're tricky. White people like to buy the drink. As a nigga, we are not prepared to turn down a free goddamn drink. We don't give a fuck what it is. Like, this is unleaded? It's spicy than a motherfucker, nigga. I like that. I had to find out the hard way. I'm drinking with some white people. They buying me these goddamn drinks. This shit was delicious. It was called Zambuki, and I should have known that don't even sound like no shit a nigga should be drinking any goddamn way. Sound like one of my African cousins or some shit. But the shit was delicious, but it was coffee and alcohol together. I was knocking them bitches back. It wasn't until I got fucked up that I realized that maybe... Maybe this is not the right combination of shit for a nigga to be fucked up on, cause now I'm fucked up. I'm at the house, a nigga is fucked up, but I can't pass out. I'm just in the house, nigga, I am fucked up. No, I'm cool, nigga, I'm cool, nigga, I'm cool, <laughs> fuck that. Let's get the day started. Do you made me laugh a lot? Does he straighten his hair? If he must do, mustn't he? Yeah. I love his hair. He's got, he's got yeah, a very green, a unique his green suit. look. Yeah. Yeah, because I loved, I loved his like velvet green. Yeah. Like I'd actually wear something like that. Laser. Yeah, with his laser. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no, I think we have some more of them because uh, he's quite funny. Yeah. Yeah, probably uh, a bit of a longer one or something. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, because that was only about three yeah. and a half minutes. Yeah. Yeah, you'll yeah, have to give us some um, recommendations. Yeah, give yes. us some. Uh, uh, titles that Cat Williams has done, and we'll, we'll take a look. Yeah, definitely. Or if there's any other comedians as well. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Name yeah. the comedians down below. Yes. And we'll Please look do. through the comments. Yeah. And also, don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that yeah. bell. Yeah. Hit the bell. And go over to our Patreon channel. Just $3 per month. Yeah. Just the one tier of it. content, Sophieisms, movie reviews, competitions. Yeah, you, you can win prizes on it. Yeah. Can actually spend three three dollars for the month and then win more money back. Yeah, would be nice. It would be ready it? for the summer. Yeah, yeah exactly. Who, would, who who says no? <laughs> exactly. So uh, yeah, make sure you like and subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Cheers. Bye.